name's Shelley Flett. I'm a leadership development and team performance expert. Today I'd like to talk to you about increasing your awareness to avoid emotional outbursts. So what do I mean by emotional outbursts? Have you ever been in a situation where someone has said something the wrong way or at the wrong time and you've totally lost it? You've completely unleashed on them and you've walked away from that thinking that was probably really unreasonable um, and really unwarranted. So what is it that we can do to prevent this? We don't become infuriated or angry straight away. There are often triggers that get us to that stage and increasing your awareness is really around identifying the point at which you need to do something. So take for example a staff member who has done something that you think that's really probably not what I would expect from someone you know in your role or at your position but I'm not going to do anything about it. I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to let it go. But I'm feeling a little bit irritated by it. And so you let it go and the staff's behaviour continues to carry on. And over time you become annoyed and frustrated and eventually you get angry and quite often um, you can go into rage if, it, if they get in touch with you or they come and speak to you at the wrong time. And so understanding the trigger at which you need to actually intervene and say, what you're doing is not okay, or I'm not comfortable with how you're approaching this, will really help defuse the situation before it escalates. So it's about understanding yourself, understanding your emotions, and really getting in and intervening before it becomes detrimental, not only to your career, but to the development of the your, your staff and the people in your team.